couple <coughs> a couple of guys have asked me to um break down this morning fog there's song in its own little orbit over the years um I've not done a tutorial before but here goes um I'm not big on the lexicon with the terms but um pretty much in a b b major shape i start i start off with so i'm going to pull two strings with right hand your a and your e these but finger there there and there with your bar that's how it begins sorry yeah so i i take my finger off and little finger off from the b so you got your b you know some people do it like that but if you're on the floor, I'm not touching the, the bottom of here. So B and E together, and then hit your open B string. So I'm going slide it down to some kind of A sus, I think. So you've got. C major and just using your pink, uh, pinky. All you're doing alternate bass over there. And then up to this kind of A with a Sometimes just do that then and the rest open so go. Sometimes just using two fingers, uh, if, if I get lazy, but you can use three. You all need three, yeah. Uh... So that's pretty much the structure of the song based around um, some kind of B, some kind of A, and a, an E major with a... And then the, the other one is with some kind of... Um, up to the solo and I'll sort of after that E I'll slide up to which is 7, 8 and 9 fret and if you can see that shape there it's just that's the shape so it's a three fingered chord on the 8th, 9th and 10th fret so you just do that and slide the same shape down two frets and then down one fret, but when you go down this one, these two fingers here, I'm going to turn sort of upside down, like that. So you're going from there. It's there, and then I'll revert, invert the uh, style of picking. I go, and then I'll, and then I'll drop, drop in the um, the same riff, a lower octave. And this is quite hard shape to get used to. I found it difficult at first. Kept going off at board, but. Like, just like that. And again, I'll invert it. So, 
So yeah, so that um, is a seventh fret on your E string with your pinky. You're going to need your pinky on this. Second, uh, sixth fret on that that one there, and then leave, leave that one free. And next string down, which is your D string there. Slide the same shape down to there. Then you switch the, the, that this finger here onto your E string, and then you move this one here down to the B note and the E note there, the octave E. So you've got, and then back up to, and then invert it if you like. And then you have to sort of get. Right quick there. There's you got your begin to bleed. Oops there. And then we're so that's your main section have gone up, you know, we've done that bit. Um, then that's a three fingered chord on the first voice three strings and then that is a full B so I'm knitting a, like in the beginning when I went um, um, hitting two octaves at the same time and same with the, it's same when you do this little sort of committing two octaves, that one. Oh, that's not an octave, is it? Yes, it is. Uh, open. Oh, no, sorry, it isn't. That's it. I'm going to do it clean. the beginning of the original by Kaver, 12th and 14th fret, and that's two, there, so you got that little drill, so that's all you can octave it. That's it. I hope I, I hope I explained that best I could for the first attempt, but um, and not going too fast. So we. Uh...
Hold on, Steve. to invert that when you as opposed to that shape there. And then I think um is it still recording? Let's just check. 